Hello guys, welcome back to my video and in this video I would like to share my process on how I model this character over here. So this video is part of my game devlog so in case you are new to here, welcome and be sure to check my other devlog, the link is in the description and somewhere on top of this video. Alright so without further ado, let's jump into the process. Okay so first of all this model will be a low poly model so we are going to use mesh modeling technique. So the technique is quite simple, we just need to map the reference to create a simple geometry on top of it. Okay now we have come to the rigging process and here I'm actually using a rigify add-on and it is a rigging add-on for blender and you can activate it in your blender preferences settings of course. Here I assigned a vertex group on specific bones and this technique is uh, the technique that I'm using for rigging for in case a low poly model because it's pretty easy to use. So I actually have covered this kind of rigging process in detail in previous devlogs so be sure to check them out for better understanding.
Alright, so the UV mapping process is quite simple, just like an ordinary UV unwrapping and creating UV island by scaling and repositioning the UV wrap. For need UV, it's better to scale each wrap uniformly and place them between a reasonable cap. Now is the texturing process, it's pretty basic here, I just start painting on the layers by using the drop brush and sometimes full fill the entire layers by using gradient tools in Blender. Unfortunately, Blender doesn't have layers organizers such as painting software like Photoshop or Clip Studio Paint. At least for the version that I'm using is Blender 2.8, but you can manipulate such features by setting up simple nodes and then you are ready to go.
And there it is, I created simple tin shader and I think the result is pretty good. Anyway, thank you for watching this video, give a like if you like, subscribe for more content like this, and until then, see you next time.